I'm François Simon from Brewery L'Hermitage. And uh, what is L'Hermitage doing in terms of uh, green practices and also in terms of engagement with the local community in Brussels? Um, what we try to do in our brewery is to... We, are, we work with human-sized brewery. We try to be involved in our community as in Brussels. We sell, I think, 95% of our beers in Brussels. Uh, and what was very important for us in our project is because two of uh, the three founders, me and Nassim, uh, worked before in two more cultural and artistic community. So it was important to, to make a tap room in a Brussels center and having a lot of cultural even then to, to use the beer, not as the final point, but as more, more to, to link people, to link culture, to link concert, to link art, to link paintings, to link all the Brussels community into, into the this, this, this same place. It was very important for us not to just do beer, not to do just production, to a very like Brussels brewery, but also a Brussels project, I think. And are you looking at turning any of your practices into environmentally friendly practices? Yeah, we, um, because of the, I don't know in English, the word for dresh, we saw the last of the, of, of, the, of the grains. Uh, we try more and more with um, some local industry like um, Champignon Brussels, who, who come to take our dresh to, um, to, to grow some mushrooms. And we are looking for more and more projects like this to, to lost, try to lose nothing. Uh, which is very difficult. We, we um, our, our brewery system permits us to to, uh, to to save water, of course, to, to keep the water for the um, the cooling and to staying to the process always. But yeah, in terms of grain, because grain has still a lot of energy in it, so you try to to keep it for the, uh, other people like farms, like mushrooms, like like any project we can. We are also. Uh, involved into a little farm, new farm into Anderlecht, uh, in Abattoir Anderlecht, uh, which, which try to collaborate a lot of the most we can, but yeah, it's just little by little.